AWS partnership with Lincoln Electric in order to bring about a virtual reality experience for kids and, and all the uh, newcomers of, of this show to get an opportunity to see what we're doing as far as cutting edge technology. helmet look inside here and I can go into a virtual reality world so if I'm looking at this virtual reality world right now this is the thing these are the things that I'm actually seeing up here on the flag screen so as I'm looking around right now I see uh, different types of places excuse me different types of places around uh, as far as this desert is concerned here okay so now if I want to actually weld this process I would come over here to this area I would grab the stick here and you guys can see up on the screen exactly what I'm looking at. I would position myself accordingly, look into the screen, and then I would begin to do the welding process. And we have different parameters set, so it helps you know exactly how close you need to get to the workpiece. And then you go through the process. Press my scroll right weld. now, which is not going to be good, based upon the fact that I didn't finish the weld, but I would press end pass. It would give me a score. That's a 16%. <laughs> but, I'm sure you'll do a lot better than yes, I will. Yeah. Yes. And so, so it basically just shows me uh, next time what things I need to work on. I need to uh, do well, better on my travel speed uh, to get my percentages up. And each percentage can be worth at least 100% on each one of these welds. So, What's the highest score that you can get? The highest score that I've gotten personally was a 98. <laughs> you can get 100%, but it's based upon technique is based upon whether or not uh, how much um, welding experience you actually have and so all we do is try to improve upon what you're doing and and, and get you some um, muscle memory so that you can do better when it comes to going uh, doing real welding so 16 really isn't good at all no it's bad <laughs>